I'm Angelo George, uh, I'm a cave explorer, and uh, a long time ago um, we uh, were caving in what we thought was the largest cave in, in north central Kentucky, and it was called Big Bat. And it's one of these caves where you, you hear stories, and and the more stories that you heard about Big Bat, uh, the bigger the cave became. And so our interest was, was piqued uh, because there was this Shangri-La type uh, grotto out there and we didn't know where it was. But Chris Gray one day said that he knew where it was and it was, it was near Letcher Langston's farm and it was northwest of High Plains. Now this was one of many, many locations that we had for Big Bat Cave. And we uh, uh, searched, boondocked, and never found it. Well, in, uh, in 1966, uh, I was a geology student at University of Louisville and circulating in the geology department was this mythic cave called Big Bat but no one knew where it was and it was like trying to uh, cross the sound barrier we knew it was out there but we, we would get close and it would evaporate in front of us well there was a um, a geology student that was next to me and his name was John Huffman. Uh, Huffman knew where the cave was. He had been in it and he talked about miles and miles of gypsum, crawlways and walkways, humongous passages and my eyes were going like this, yes, yes. And uh, uh, following day I brought in some maps and he put a dot on the topo map. Well, he said, I know this other guy that's been to the cave also. His name is John Rhines. And he gave me his telephone number. And so we called Rhines up. And he says, not only can I put a dot on the map, I can take you there. Well, that's even better. We got a guide. So in, in March of 1966, and we're going back decades now. This is back where we had covered wagons, <laughs> almost. And uh, so, uh, Neil Whitehead and I, we got in his old Junker pickup truck, and, uh, and Pat Stevens and John Schmidt were with Ryan's. And so, we checked out the first location Neil and I did that uh, John Huffman gave us. And uh, we crawled around these, these sinkholes, no cave. It's, it's one of these cave entrances. That it's a giant entrance, you can't miss it. And, and where we were uh, just wasn't the right place. And so Ryan says, I know where it is. So he took us to another spot and another spot and another spot. None of them were the entrance of Big Bat. So we were thinking, well, we were maybe a little bit too gullible. And, uh, but Ryan, you know, swore to us, it's a real cave. I've been to it, but nothing looks right. Now, now Ryan's is, uh, at this time, was um, uh, ex-Army. Uh, he was uh, stationed in Hawaii, uh, a vertical rescue team. And so he had a lot of uh, uh, ro rope work uh, expertise. And so we, and he was also a caver. And, and so we, um, we had a lot of respect for him, but we were really starting to suspect his veracity. 
So we went to Custer, and there's a general store there, and uh, we uh, uh, asked around, do you know where Big Bad is? Cave. And uh, the town drunk, his name was Guy Lyons, and he says, I know where it is. It's on my cousin's property, and I'll take you there. So he took us there, and it, and we followed him, and his car was all over the road. And we parked, got out, walked to the entrance, and uh, Ryan says, that's Big Bad. So we, we thanked Mr. Lyons, and uh, he went on his way, and we went in the cave. It was already getting late, but we... We made it all the way to the junction box, and uh, and we were we were certain that this is the cave of all caves. And one of the things about Big Bat and and initially going there, I'm looking at my geologic quadrangle, and. There can't be any caves here. It's all sandstone. There's 170 feet of sandstone on on top of the Paoli before you can even get in into the cave. No way, Jose, can there be any cave here, but there was. And uh, so the the next trip, uh, we went to the cave. Uh, Bob Walker was there, and. Uh, and we made it to the mountain rooms. And it's one of these uh, ta-da moments. And, uh, and it was the stories that we heard about the cave were true. <laughs>